can you invest in Mirai Asset, NYSC, FANG fund, ETF fund. So it's a very different fund kind of fund. So I just wanted to uh, share that. This is one thing you should watch for sure. So hi, hello, this is Ganesh Santuru, your stock market profit coach. I help in multiplying your money by investing in stock market. And this is my book, One Page Stock Market Plan, which you can uh, check it out on Amazon. Please check the description link and kindly click the subscriber button so that uh, I'll keep posting regular videos on all these important stuff. So today's topic is all about the NFO, which is coming up by Mirai Asset. Mirai Asset is one of the top fund house in India and they are one of the top uh, foreign uh, fund house in India. And uh, most of their funds are doing extremely good in mid cap, tax saver, emerging blue chip, right? Everything is doing extremely good and they are coming up with a new fund offer and which is ending by April 30, but no worries. It is getting reopened by 7th May, right? So once it is open, whatever the price you can invest again. So that is the beauty of uh, mutual funds. So the NFO period is getting over. You don't need to rush. You can always get on. Uh, even if you are watching later after a week or so, uh, you can always invest in this fund after 7th May because on 7th May it is getting listed. So you can always go online and list. But what is that NYSC? The New York, New York Stock Exchange Fund, New York Stock Exchange Index. So that is similar to Sensex, New York Stock Exchange as NYSC ETF. So even in that ETF, this fund is going to invest only in the top 10 companies, top 10 companies in that ETF. So I'll be in a moment sharing what is that top 10 companies. And this is a concentrated ETF. So first, let me show what is that uh, fund. So these are the companies, uh, Alibaba, you know, similar, uh, they are the biggest in China and they are the huge marketplace in China <coughs> and Facebook. We all know Facebook, Alphabet, the parent company of Google, the Apple is there, Baidu, the Baidu is uh, similar to Google. They are the search engine based out of China and that is the, because of the population. Baidu is also one of the biggest company and NVIDIA, again, it's a big, big uh, gaming platform. Uh, they also produce uh, something like uh, on the games for, and it is one of the top company. And Amazon, we all know Amazon, we all know Netflix, we all know Twitter and we all know Tesla, which is a huge company. So all these 10 companies are huge. And why they selected these 10 companies is that by the market cap, they are the third largest country, similar to the third largest country by GDP. That is a kind of uh, revenue they make. That is a kind of growth they make year on year. And in a moment, I'll be showing you how much returns this fund has, could have generated in the last seven years from the time of forming this NY, uh, this FA, NYSC FANG stocks from the time it got listed. I mean, everything together, we are going to see how much. And what is the advantage of investing in this fund is that it is an ETF. So similarly, you can trade uh, similar to a stock. So you need a DMAT account to invest in this and then you can start doing it. And uh, these are the 10 stocks. Uh, these are the 10 stocks which you are seeing on screen. Let's look at the returns which it could have generated in the last seven years. And on comparison, right? Total sum invested is 7.8 lakhs per month. You are investing, I think, around 10,000 rupees per month in SIP mode. Uh, just look at the value of investment is around 33.5 lakhs in this in the NYSC FANG stock in last seven years from September 14 to till now. Whereas in NASDAQ, it's another exchange in US, it is just 19.3 lakhs, almost close to 50% down. And in the case of S&P 500 index in uh, India, I think that is also an index. Uh, let's consider US itself. It is also 14 lakhs. If you consider Nifty 50 index in India, it is just 12.2 lakhs, 12.2. We may see that is a huge shift, but for seven years, this is a, this is the approximate amount we used to get in India. But just look at the NYC FANG stock. It's highly concentrated and all these companies always invest for the future. If you consider Google, if you consider Alphabet, that's a parent company. They have so much. Google is just search engine, but including Google, they have so many products including YouTube, the revenues increasing multifold and Alpha and Apple and all these companies, they always think 10 years ahead, five years ahead. They always have the products for the next two, three years. So with this same thing, all these with these kind of companies in, uh, in this, ten, because these are just 10 stocks inside this mutual fund, inside the ZTF. And remember any mutual fund in India or anywhere, they used to invest in minimum 30 plus. And even the focused equity fund in most of the companies nowadays having 25 companies for sure. But this fund is coming up with a very concentrated fund that too in US with 10 stocks alone. That is a, I think that's a game changer. And 
and that also brings in the risk factor because risk is going to be huge because the only the 10 stocks are going to get listed and among these 10 stocks uh, we, we all know what are the 10 stocks and uh, that will perform and similar to the ETF you don't need the expense ratio is going to be very very less that is a huge advantage and they, this once the for units are declared and the price is found out on 6th May on 7th May it will get listed in uh, NSC and BSC platform and the advantage is that even if the rupee depreciates that will affect the returns which means once the rupee depreciates automatically the it will reflect in the returns of this fund so we have double returns so if you are a long term investor invest for long term and one fund which you can compare with this kind of fund is Mo Motilal Oswal Nasdaq 100 ETF because that has given I think around more than 20-25% returns for the last 10 years 25% returns compounded for the last 10 years whereas this fund is giving around almost like uh, it's a new NFO we need to see but the returns it is showing on the screen this is the kind of returns for that investment amount whatever you made it would have given more than close to almost five times the returns in the span of not even seven years not even seven years is completed so if you are someone who is really interested to make more money who are ready to take some kind of risk but what is available in the future even if the entire market uh, goes down we don't know what will happen to these kind of companies uh, that needs to be tested that is a risk factor associated because it looks everything is good on paper it looks everything is good while back testing and it looks this company the, this fund these 10 companies will do good in the future also but everything needs to be tested what will happen if uh, any testing times comes what will happen if the market crashes and the valuations are very very high and the concentration of these companies are very high in the ETF uh, in US and also uh, everybody are banking on these companies so let's see what is going to happen in the coming days but buy SIP this is one of the best thing to do you can start SIP as an lump sum uh, investment uh, maybe you should be cautious enough uh, maybe you, should, you can uh, once get listed you can see how it is going and uh, you can see over a period of time you can see whether you can invest in lump sum manner and one thing is if, if still if you want to go for lump sum maybe you need to wait for a couple of more years two to three years down the line you can see how it works uh, maybe in the next six months uh, we need to see because only when the US market reacts you will see what is happening so uh, how we will know you need to track this fund you need to track all these stocks if possible and that is the only disadvantage you cannot track because uh, you can just see whether this fund, fund is going up or this fund is going down but you cannot see why this fund is going down why this fund is going up unless you are a global investor unless you are okay to track US stocks that to these particular stocks because you need to track all these stocks by separately then only you will come to know or else uh, let's see how this uh, fund is going to share the uh, results and all these data then only we will come to know so hope you uh, uh, take an informed decision with this review kindly share this review with your friends who wants to diversify and get into global investing because it's a fund of fund model no, no problems you can always invest so if you are someone looking to invest in US market this is one fund you should not miss, uh, miss and that too investing in Apple all these kind of stocks don't miss it. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please share this video and please click the subscriber button. Thank you so much.